Hello everybody, today we're installing our Bluetooth extension for GTA car kits in the 2006 Honda Civic. In the previous video we showed you how to take everything apart, how to remove the radio and how to install our GTA car kit. And today we're going to be ins installing the extension which plugs in into this uh, GTA car kit module uh, in order for you to have Bluetooth. So the three extra parts that come with Bluetooth are is this uh, Bluetooth uh, remote control and the actual Bluetooth so this will be hidden behind the radio and then we're gonna have a microphone that we're gonna wire to the A pillar and we're gonna have a remote control to control the whole thing and we're gonna show you a couple of places where you can wire this one so we're gonna go ahead and the first thing we're gonna do is wire the microphone and for that we're gonna open the door and uh, take this rubber seal and peel it back so this gives us room in order to feed the microphone and uh, in the previous video we didn't show you how to remove this so you just pop this panel off and take it out and we're gonna take our microphone I'm gonna put it back. We have it here. And when, once you're fishing the wire or like putting the wire through, just start putting back the rubber. And here we're gonna get it inside. So basically the whole point you have to wire the microphone and so all the wires meet in the middle behind the radio. And when you're doing it yourself make sure you take your time to properly feed the wire through. I'm just doing it quickly for the video. So you have it here. Close the door. Now we're gonna take the radio out. On this car it's very easy because everything is uh, so open. And we have the cable here. So now you're gonna take your uh, Bluetooth uh, module and we're gonna connect uh, the microphone into the mic slot. And then you have a couple of options where to wire this uh, button. Uh, I personally think it's uh, for this button it's a good idea to once the radio is removed you can see that uh, this opening that we showed in the previous video how to open it how to get the two bolts in order to take out the radio here you can uh, feed the wire up and then uh, because this has a 3m tape on the back and you just tape it inside of the pocket there and it's very discreet and then just put the panel back and nobody will even notice it. Another option is to put it in somewhere around here but there's a chance that you can uh, touch it every time you're switching turning on your wipers so it's up to you this car because everything is out it's wherever you stick it just make sure that if you're putting it like in this place that it doesn't jam the wire and if it jams the wire then you can damage damage it you have to replace it so we're gonna take the button and for this customer we're gonna put it in into this in the middle there like I showed first so for now we're gonna just put it at, 
everything right there in order to show you how everything works but when you're wiring everything in we suggest putting and hiding everything including the GTA module the Bluetooth module everything behind here and in case you have to adjust something or the wire comes loose you can just take this bottom cover out and you can reach it with your hand and so you don't have to take everything out so now we're gonna put in our GTA car kit like we showed in the first video just like that and we're gonna connect the actual Bluetooth to our GTA car kit just like that so now basically everything is wired uh, just ignore this mess it will be all hidden once it's done and the only thing you're gonna have is this uh, button and the uh, mic that we wired over there right now we're gonna test everything and we just hit all the wires at the back like we told you earlier and uh, so you have to control it by the button so right now we're gonna turn it to the first position and go to the GTA car kits mode so to do that you have to press the aux button on this particular car and uh, takes you you can there's two options CD3 and CD4 so we're gonna have to go to CD4 and we're gonna take our phone and pair it so when there's nothing paired it's just gonna be flashing rapidly and we're gonna so it means it's looking to pair to Bluetooth so we're gonna go and try to search it in our devices and it will work with iPhone Android any Bluetooth phone so right here it shows GTA car kit not pairs so we're gonna pair to it and now it's connected you're gonna hear two beeps and this slide just stays uh, solid red so now you can go to your music and start playing your song and we suggest uh, having your uh, on, on uh, your phone we suggest having the volume around 75 percent to be the same volume as your uh, stereo system and it's pretty simple to use you just scroll through you can uh, uh, if you hold this button down uh, for three seconds you can uh, activate your Siri and you can use it for whatever commands you use Siri for and uh, when the phone call comes in and we're gonna demonstrate right now uh, so right now the music is playing from your iTunes and once the phone call comes in you can either answer if your phone is somewhere not in a close reach you can answer with this button you can hang up with this button or you can answer from the phone so we're gonna answer with the button and now it's a Bluetooth phone call and now you can hang up with it and music resumes to be playing from the last spot you were in but this is only with iTunes if you're playing an app with the music it will not resume the music you have to press play on the app again and uh, that's pretty much it for the using your Bluetooth and again this was a video for GTA car kits in the 2006 Honda Civic I hope you like the video and we'll see you next time